The School of Music hired Josh Boyer, marching 110 alumnus and three-year 110 TA grad student, as its first ever assistant director of marching and athletic bands last summer. Fortunately, Mr. Boyer's experience and knowledge of the 110 had prepared him for his first season as an assistant director with the marching band in 2014. The organization of the band um, and, and the way that we go about doing what we do, whether it's rehearsal performances and always, always doing everything with you know, the highest integrity and representing yourself and the university and everything, you know, all those things tied in together really kind of mold who you are. And, you know, a, a lot of us, I think we, we come through the band being better people. He's helped me the entire step of the way from my freshman year, just getting adjusted to things, to my sophomore and junior year, and especially this past year, being the field commander for the Marching 110, and him also being a field commander in 2007, he's definitely had a big impact on my life. Uh, having a third person on staff, um, which we just thought would really help the athletic bands, but also um, the band program in general, and then the school of music also, has also felt a really um, positive impact through hiring this position and Mr. Boyer in particular. He was graduating and uh, he was somebody that was very talented in the area um, and I thought well if we could keep him but also just so we could have some uh, continuous help. We always have TAs who are great um, but they stay over two years and they leave and it'd be nice to have somebody who provide some more continuity. As the 110 directors prepare for the 2015 marching season, many new changes, including the audition process and training week schedule, are being made. However, throughout the band's history and evolution, one thing has always stayed the same, the drive to be better than the best ever.